How much login do you use in your Cypress test? Well, I try to use it as much as possible, especially when debugging my tests. And did you know that the ci.log function supports markdown? That's one of the reasons why this example here points to this markdown guide cheat sheet. So we have one simple ci.visit and then a log entry. But let's end the code. So in the code, I have some parts which I commented out. So I'm expecting this message to be bold, this one to be italic, this one to be funny, and this one to be a link. So let's just save it. We go back to Cypress and I have the normal log message, the bold one, the italic, the funny, which the reason it's funny is it well it supports uh, emojis and this one has a link. So if you want to try yourself, it does support most markup. Not all, most. Have a look and write in the comments which one do you find is the most suited markdown to be used for um, logs. As always, thank you for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one. Have a good one and bye bye.